it's Brady. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. So today, let me just start off with saying that I said last week that I wasn't really doing a once a month haul for July. Um, we were just going to do weekly until August. However, um, there were just some things that I needed with the sale at Sam's Club. We had to get some other things. And so I went on ahead and basically did a once a month haul. So that's what we're gonna call this. It's not, we didn't need as much meat and everything. Basically, I just got enough meat from Sam's to last us until um, the end of July when I do our back to school August stock up haul. But you're gonna see a bunch. You can see my whole non-food pile here is huge. There's a lot of random things. Let me just introduce you to our largest purchase of this haul. And never mind all the mess around it. But, see that bad boy right there? Now, you're gonna say, Brady, that doesn't look like a very large freezer. And it's not six and a half cubic foot. However, we had a five cubic foot chest freezer, freezer that was an absolute disaster to organize. So, that bad boy was $200 worth of our um, monthly haul here. But that's what we went to Sam's Club to get and then I realized I needed other things as well. We also have my soon to be two year old's birthday party. We have two kiddos having surgery this week. We have the 4th of July. We have a lot going on. So there's a lot of junk, a lot of things that we needed um, and a lot of non-food household things. So I think the total, because I had, I bought a gift cards for $75 worth of groceries. Um, and if you are new to Ibotta, I'll link a link down below that gets you an extra $10 when you sign up using that link as soon as you re redeem your first rebate. So your first rebate could get you 50 cents back on something, but you're going to get an extra $10 back immediately just for redeeming that first rebate. And then you only need $20 to cash out. So I cashed out $75 worth of gift cards to use towards groceries. And that's what I do since I spend it on groceries out of pocket. I just roll it back into groceries. So you're going to see a lot of like birthday things, a lot of stuff in this haul. Let's get started. I think my total, <laughs> let's see, you know what? I'm going to have to do that math for you at the end there and I'll, I'll put it on the thumbnail or in the, the title here. But let's get started with non-food. So also, let me say this, let me backtrack. Before we get started, I went, I did a Walmart grocery pickup. We went to Sam's Club yesterday and then I went to Kroger this morning as well. So, and we are a family of four, if anybody's wondering, plus a dog. The dog has plenty of dog food. Um, and if you don't know, the way I shop is not week to week. I don't shop based off of our needs. I buy, shop based off what is on sale. So, there are some things like hand items that yes, I'll find the lowest price and get what we need for that month or that week. And there are some things that I'll get for a special occasion that you're going to see as well. But for the most part, I buy what is on sale each week, even when I do a monthly grocery haul. And so then I just, I keep pulling from our stock. So if you're interested to see what our pantry looks like, what my, excuse me, what my couponing stockpile looks like, what our freezers look like, let me know down in the comments down below. And I will be happy to make a video on that so you can see more what we're pulling from. Also, several, several of you have asked me um, for a what's for dinner vlog or meal plan and that sort of thing. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to share with you in a couple of days following this video. I'm going to share with you our July monthly meal plan. Keep in mind that can change week to week depending on what we're going to be having going on in our life. But what I do is I meal plan about 30 meals and then we'll just rotate them around through the month as we need them. So... Let's get started with the non-food. I got some of the match light charcoal from Kingsford. This was on sale at Kroger this week for $6.99. We will be grilling out for my soon to be two year old's birthday party. These Contigo Kids Cups are on sale at Sam's. I think this is for a few more days, maybe through the 15th of July. So maybe you have time. I know it's definitely into July. Um, and I got these for our water cups because they don't have a straw to clean. And so they're the auto seal. And so when you press the button, obviously you'll have to open the flap as well, but then you press the button and it opens so you can drink it. And then when you release the button, it closes the cup, even if they don't close that flap over. So 
These were $9.98 on sale. And those, one of those will be a back to school cup as well. And then I got the gallon of distilled white vinegar for cleaning and cleaning drains, that sort of thing. Walmart, I believe that was $1.58. Two Right Guard Sports. We got these at Kroger. Ooh, now I'm dropping stuff. I got these at Kroger. They were on sale for $1.25 a piece. And then I had a two off two e coupon. So these ended up being 25 cents a piece, which was great. I tried to get them last week when I went to Kroger, but they didn't even have any because everybody was trying to do that deal. But it was still on sale. Now, my goodness, I'm gonna keep throwing stuff on the floor. Now, I was in Kroger when I got my text message that um, my order was ready at Walmart pickup. And so I had originally put Neil Med or some other brand of the saline mist on my Walmart pickup order. And I saw when I got the mess, the email that it was out of stock and they were substituting two of these for, I think it was $2.97 for the one that I ordered. And these, they ended up only charging me $2.96 for the both of them together. We will definitely use these even more so for my two year old. But um, I went on ahead and, and let them do the substitution but I picked up this Boogie Mist saline spray at Kroger while I was there because for my older one that's gonna need this after her tonsils are taken out, we're gonna, her tonsils and adenoids, we're definitely gonna need the mist spray and not these drops. So I got that, that was $5.99 at Kroger. This is for a special before surgery treat. We are going to paint our nails together, my five-year-old and I, and this is just the Sally Hansen Insta Dry Matte, and it is a, of course, five-year-old purple, but I thought she would love that, and she has already seen it and is super excited. So that was about $3. This is part of a gift, sort of, for my my almost two-year-old. She likes these straw cups, and we needed one that was insulated. So I got the dinosaur one, Playtex, Sipsters. This was around $5 at Kroger. This was one thing that we went for at Sam's. These are $9.98 as part of the um, instant savings book that they have going on right now. And there's 24 pairs. We've been um, redecorating a lot and we love these. They hold everything. If you've never tried these command hanging strips, they're perfect. It's kind of like two Velcro pieces and then it doesn't damage your wall and you don't have to worry about finding a stud, whatever. So I got those. Normally I would get my deodorant at CVS or couponing, but guys, I'm kind of burnt on the cheap, cheap deodorant right now. And I love this motion sense degree. And then I've never tried the black and white, but it'll be just fine. Um, this was a five pack of degree motion sense at Sam's Club for $11.98. Let's see if I can get that back down in there. An air filter, this was $4.83 because I change that every month, and that's part of how I remember to do that is that I put it on my stock up for a free haul pickup. $1.25 for these gallon storage bags. There's 19 of them, we're out, and I just needed some. We don't use them every single day. And then I needed some plastic spoons, and I could, oh, there they are, and some plastic forks. I just wanted the like 12 place setting ones that they had at Kroger, but they were sold out of those. So I just got these, they were 99 cents a piece. This is for our birthday get togethers. And then I got the large paper plates. If you saw in my, a couple of hauls back, I did get a 100 count of the smaller paper plates, but we needed some bigger ones too. So I went on ahead and got those. They were on sale for $2 at Kroger and then I had a 50 cent off coupon that they mailed me in a Kroger home mailer. So $1.50 for those was a great price. These Cottonelle flushable wipes, a two pack they were $3.99 and then I had a dollar off or no a two dollar off e-coupon making them sorry guys that made those a dollar 99 for two packs great deal we can definitely use those with two little kids in the house these pioneer woman mini mints okay so I thought this was in the Walmart pickup they were $5.94 and then I had a five dollar off coupon so it was actually free um, because they had given me or it was 94 cents because they had given me a, um, like a coupon to use in my next order from where they had messed things up in the past. So um, I got those, but I thought I was getting an oven mitt and then the pot holder, but that's not what those are. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep those. 
And then I got three of these fridge and freezer baking soda packs. These things are awesome, 79 cents a piece at Kroger. These meal prep kits. So we've been wanting some divided containers for my husband to take to work. And I saw that um, our Target had these and the rectangular shape fits in his lunchbox. I saw that Target had these for $7.99, but they were $4.99 for the exact same brand and package. It's a 10 pack, 10 containers and 10 lids um, for $4.99 today at Kroger. So I went ahead and got them. 97 cents for these washers. I literally, literally only need two. And I'm gonna show you some things in our kitchen but um, for small kitchen organization, but I need that to hang something in there. So you'll see that in a future video. Um, again, we are getting tubes in one of their ears. One of their ears, no. One of my children is getting tubes in her ears. Um, and so these came recommended from um, Alia, I believe she was the one that recommended these in her video. Um, and they're recommended by ENTs. So they're kid size, the moldable silicone putty earplugs for being in the water after surgery and then I got another kids Tylenol liquid it's the acetaminophen whatever and then I needed some chewable kids ibuprofen a regular thing of baking soda we use that with the vinegar to clean drains to clean my glass top stove anything that we need to scrub scrub with and then this is a dollar 19 for the if it's gonna focus, there we go. The energy support, it's like a Kroger brand, um, five hour energy. I picked that up for my husband, $5.99 for the Kroger allergy relief as I throw it in the floor. Never mind my messy floor, guys. Okay, now we get started over here and I think what I'm gonna try to do is go through this super fast if possible because I've got frozen stuff that is quickly, quickly melting. So I got eight gallons of distilled water because we need to keep both humidifiers running. Um, that was the ENT suggestion after surgery. And then I got two loaves of white bread. One is sandwich. One is the like rounded loaf. I only purchased one of those on the Walmart pickup. So I don't know if like they picked this up first and then meant to get that one and then found it. And then I don't know, but they were 88 cents and I was only charged for one of them. So we'll take it. I don't know. I didn't even realize that till we got home. $3.99 for these Danimal smoothies, the Toy Story ones again at Kroger. And then I got three at Walmart of these Danimal squeeze yogurts. Yes, I know that's a rip off because I paid $10.50 for 12 pouches, if you count all three boxes, of these yogurts. However, um, it's what my girls love and it's gonna get them to eat things after surgery, so we're getting those. Two things of the vanilla unsweetened almond milk from Great Value a gallon of Milo's tea and then a gallon of whole milk that was $2.59 at Walmart hopefully it does not go bad this time the last one we got went bad a couple of days before the date we got a yo crunch yogurt with Oreo and a yo crunch with M&Ms as a treat after surgery as well those were 64 cents a piece at Walmart these Nathan skinless beef franks, these are for the two-year-old birthday party, and they were $1.99 as part of the, um, like, digital coupon sale for Friday, Saturday, Sunday at Kroger this week. Um, 79 cents for the large 12 dozen eggs. However, I had a coupon for 40 cents off, so I only paid 39 cents for a dozen of eggs, so we'll definitely use those. And then these were free, the Cracker Barrel little mini bags of extra sharp cheddar cheese cubes. There's, this is a two ounce bag. They were on sale for a dollar at a dollar off the coupon. Easy freebie. A dollar for the French onion dip. Two sour creams were a dollar a piece at Kroger as well. These were from, these yogurts were also from Walmart. They were 64 cents a piece. The Dunkin' varieties of French vanilla latte and an apple fritter. Those are for my husband for a treat. I got some more Swiss cheese, $1.88 for package this is what's also melting but this is a treat for after surgery as well an m&m cookie sandwich so for a dollar the snickers um, ice cream bar was a dollar at walmart as well i got a pound of boar's head oven gold turkey this was 9.35 because it was a little over a pound 
I got a 12 pack of these Jellos. Um, she can't have the red after surgery, but she can have the other flavors, and that was the easiest way to get anything but red. And those were $2.74 at Walmart. The snack packs of um, pudding were 80 cents a piece after a 20 cent off e coupon that I had on my Kroger card. So I got a vanilla and then a milk chocolate and a chocolate fudge pack. The zesty Italian Kroger dressing is actually for a marinade. I love how it says dress and marinade now um, because that's what we use Italian dressing for. Um, and that was 99 cents after a 50 cent e coupon. Three of these um, boxes of four pouches of unsweetened applesauce from Great Value. They were $1.53. They are a little cheaper at Aldi, but I didn't make it to Aldi, so that's where I got it. Kroger Deluxe Mac and Cheese. We still have some of that. You've seen me purchase that in other hauls, but um, with surgery, I wanted soft foods, and so I got another box to have on hand just in case we need that, and it was $1.19. Another surgery treat, something soft, chocolate chip mini muffins, a little Debbie ones. These were $1.98 at the Walmart pickup. We got the Hostess Donuts Powdered Sugar Donuts. These are also for after surgery. Those were $1.99. And these were end up being $2.99 a pint for the Ben and Jerry's, the Tonight Dough, and the Caramel Sutra Core Ice Cream Pints. Those are a treat for my husband and I because you know what? We're not going through surgery, but we're taking care of everybody. So that's our treat. Um, Monterey Jack shredded cheese. I got another one of those for $1.88. Not as good as my 99 cent a bag that I picked up last week, but I need that to make some quesadillas for the freezer. $6.99. It was kind of highway, robber, highway robbery, but the girls really like these chicken nuggets. They're gluten free if you need that as an option. Um, I really like it that it's not like super fine minced meat, so $6.99 for those. These golden waffle fries, the golden crinkles, which I got two bags of, and then the diced hash brown potatoes from Orida were $1.99 with a five-time digital coupon sale this weekend at Kroger. And um, I also had, for all this frozen stuff, I also had a $3 off your $15 frozen purchase coupon from Kroger. So... That definitely helped. If you basically want to look at it, those stayed $1.99. These stayed $2.99, but this only became $3.99. So, paid off there. This is from Walmart. Obviously, it's the Great Value 12 count. Birthday cake, ice cream cups. These were $1.99 or $2.50, something like that. Um, and that's going to be for the birthday party as well. My mom is bringing a cookie cake. Um, but we're going to have those little ice cream cups to go with it. And then the girls can have them after surgery also. $1.99 for the Eggo chocolate chip waffles after a 50 cent coupon at Kroger. Let's see if I can show you this back here. Um, this is a six pack of the like 19 ounce or whatever they are. Dr. Pepper bottles for $3. A um, hundred of the Popeye's freezer pops. The girls love these and I know we are going to need them. Not just for summer, but after surgery, obviously. You're going to hear me say that a whole lot in this haul. Um, but those were $4.89 or $4.98 for those. Sam's Club, I got two packs of their top sirloin steaks. They were both around $9 a piece. So that's what's in there. I move this out of the way. I got a package of stew meat for $4.28 a pound. Again, probably a robbery. But I don't feel like cutting up a roast right now. I need an easy crock pot meal for after the girls have surgery. So, $15.24 for that. Two packages for $1.68 per pound of boneless, skinless chicken breast. They were both about $10 a piece. And we still have chicken in the freezer, so that's why. Um, the Jimmy Dean Fully Cooked Turkey Sausage Patties. These were $7.98, I believe, at... Um, Sam's Club so they weren't on sale but um, it's a great addition to breakfast that makes it easy so we got those and then I got these Jimmy Dean pancake and sausage on a stick these were seven something on sale with the instant savings at um, Sam's Club chicken bites we still have a half a bag left of these from my June haul, but I wanted to get some more while we were there because if you don't know, our Sam's Club is about 40 minutes away each way. So, you know, it ends up being a haul to go there. 
for us, I know other people drive further, but for us, that's not in our town, so it is difficult. Um, so $9.98 for those. Five of these Mio's, they were on sale with the digital coupons that you could use up to five times at Kroger, made them $1.99 a piece. And my husband loves those, so I stocked up on all five. 59 cents for the Kroger fried rice seasoning mix. We love that. We're gonna make an easy fried rice meal out of that one night. I got 10 of these tummy yummies. These were the girls' favorite drinks. Um, for after surgery, just as something to get them to stay hydrated because my girls won't drink Pedialyte to save it. So, um, I got 10 of those. One of those is already missing because they've already broken into those, but I made them wait for the rest of them for after surgery. Um, but we got those and they were 75 cents a piece. So not as good of a deal as they have been, but if it gets them to stay hydrated and not go back to the hospital, I'm good with that. $1.99 is part of the digital savings this weekend for Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Double stuff Oreo, family size pack. They also had, um, a couple of other things included. And then there's a dollar rebate on Saving Star that you get back as well on these. And then I think a dollar off two Nabisco products back there for Saving Star that I'm also gonna submit. A dollar 88 for a personal size watermelon. That is for the birthday party. You've heard me say that I don't typically cut up my own watermelons anymore. Um, but I didn't feel like going to Publix today, and that was um, cheaper than getting their sliced watermelon at Kroger. So that's what I got. We're gonna hope it's good. Two ninety-eight for these mini bagels. I think there's sixteen in here for the girls. Yep, sixteen count. Mini plain bagels. We've tried flavored bagels. They don't care. They just want the mini plain ones. So that's what I got. Um, we'll put those in the freezer because there's definitely still bagels here from the last haul. I got the six count of the Allen's green beans from Sam's Club for $4.98. 88 cents for the Margaret Holmes seasoned cabbage from the Walmart pickup. 50 cents for the beef broth. This was a substitution order, the great value, but they substituted the Swanson, which I think is double the price, but I only still paid 50 cents. Two dark kidney beans, great value. They were 49 cents a piece. And two pinto beans, 49 cents a piece, great value as well. This is our favorite, favorite, favorite peanut butter. It's normally $1.79, but I had 50 cent off e-coupon. You could use up to five times. I only got three because we still have some peanut butter. Um, but I got three of these for $1.29 a piece. These, ah, I can't reach over all this stuff. Okay, these um, McCormick Grill Mates, um, we really like this Montreal steak. And we've never tried the hamburger, but we're gonna give that a try when we grill out this weekend. Um, or this week for her party. However, these were $1.99 and then I had a dollar off e coupon you could use up to five times. So that made those 99 cents a piece. The Pringles were a dollar a piece and then I got, so I got three of them and then I had a dollar off three coupons. So they ended up being 67 cents a piece. Um, we, Lord knows, we definitely have enough snacks. However, I wanted to make sure um, that we had just that deal stocked up uh, because it was on sale. A dollar for these salted roasted peanuts. Those are mommy snack. $1.99 for this homestyle fettuccine. Y'all are probably sick of seeing this in my hauls, <laughs> but there's a $1.99 rebate still on Ibotta, so those will be totally free. Um, that was from Kroger. And then the family size Ritz were $1.99 with that five times savings this weekend. Family size of the chicken and a biscuit crackers were also $1.99. Then I'll submit a dollar off to Saving Star Rebate for the Nabisco products. And then a dollar, I think these were $1.38 for the mixed grain cereal bars. We still have plenty, but I wanted to get another box since we're stocking up for the month. And then 98 cents for the ripple potato chips for the party. And also the jalapeno ranch for my husband, they were $1.50 with a dollar off e-coupon, a dollar off e-coupon, and these also made these Cheetos a dollar fifty, and that's what the girls will want um, with their hot dogs and everything this weekend, or this week for the party. Um, I got the pack of the right brand. I already stuck this in the freezer last night, but you can see it's the Applewood smoked four and a half pounds of right brand bacon for $18.98 at Sam's Club. 
Also at Sam's Club, 572. You can see the girls broke into that for a snack. Um, but we got the 40 count of the Lance Toasty Crackers for 572. Those, um, the strawberry cream wafer cookies were 89 cents or 88 cents at Walmart. Those are actually part of the two year old's birthday gift because she loves those. Big bars were $7.88 at Sam's Club. That's a great deal. And it comes with blueberry and raspberry. And four creamy chicken ramen noodles for 18 cents a piece. We definitely still have some ramen left, but again, we're stocking up for the month and we need easy stuff. $3.99 for the 18 ounce package of blueberries. Um, they were totally out of my $1.99 a bag for the three pound bags or $1.59 a bag for the three pound bags of yellow onions at Kroger. So I got three just individual onions. I got cilantro for 78 cents at Walmart. 49 cents for three cucumbers. I can't wait till we actually have cucumbers out of our little mini garden outside so I can stop buying those. Um, so three of those for 49 cents. Another package of baby carrots because we go through those like crazy with the dog snacking on them and everyone else snacking on them. Um, so they were 99 cents and I had a 40 cent off coupon that they mailed me yet again. Hey Kroger, I'll take it. So they ended up being 59 cents a bag. We still have some left, but we're gonna fly through those. 3.98 for a three pound bag of mandarin oranges. They're actually good this time, so hopefully they taste good. Over here, still in the package because they are leaking. We got three packages of three pounds each. So nine pounds total for $1.99 a pound of the Kroger 80-20 ground beef. Um, you could not beat that. This three pound package is normally 11 something. Um, and we paid $5.97 for each one. So about half off of what they are normally at Kroger. And then I got four green bell peppers at Kroger for 59 cents a piece. Two limes at Walmart for 38 cents a piece. One red onion to put on the grill. And I think that was like 65 cents at Kroger. 25 cents an ear for four ears of corn. So they were a dollar at Walmart and it actually looks really, really good today. We're gonna throw those on the grill for the party as well. And last but not least, a three pound, no, I'm wrong, five pound bag of golden potatoes for um, my loaded baked potato casserole and just for meals this month. And that is everything that we got. Holy cow. So much stuff, um, more stuff than I had intended on buying this week. But that's the beauty of setting aside your weekly money. If you don't use it all, then you can use it on bigger hauls. And then, obviously, $200 of this big number you're going to see was the freezer. So, that's everything we picked up today. Let me know some spectacular deals you are finding. I can't talk today. Um, thank you so much for joining me. I'm so glad to have you here on my channel. And um, I will link our playlist here at the end. It should be popping up of my other once a month grocery hauls that you can check out um and yeah so like this video if you enjoyed it please and you are always welcome to subscribe i'd love to have you join the family and we will see you in the next video bye guys